Today I'm going to show you how to put RPM filtering on your drone. I know, exciting. Blue J or whatever for your BLLES. First you're going to just go escconfigurator.com. See that? Go there. And now make sure that beta flight is not open. You want to make sure your beta flight is closed because you don't want it to be connecting to beta flight. As I have my beta flight open. Okay. So we go here. And now we are going to first plug in our drone. And we want to have a fully charged battery too. So plug in your drone. Okay. Now you hit connect. And now after you've hit connect and it doesn't connect, you're going to go to port selection, select the right port, connect, and now see if that works. Connect. Oh, it connected. Now you're going to plug in your drone and you're going to make sure that your props are on because you want to keep things spicy, okay? Now we're going to, after you plug the battery, you click read settings. You make sure that your radio is not on also, okay? Make sure your radio is not on. Now, one thing that you can do just off the bat is you can just bump this up. You just bump it up for the sake of it because sometimes there's like starting problems if you don't have this up. So just bump it up just like mine. That's the perfect amount because I said so. You see the reversed stuff, so it seems that the top... Uh, the middle two are reversed but either way it doesn't matter I have it on 48 so what I suggest you do with this is flash all ESC's and this is where you can put music and stuff too but I'm not gonna teach you cuz Top Gun's mine okay you're not allowed to use Top Gun so the version you got the Blue Jay the GH 30 is what you're using let's put the newest version on select um, okay so now 24 should give you like the more like low end control 48 is kind of a little bit more medium and then 96 is more like high end control uh you'll get the best flight times most likely with 96 but 48 is like the happy in between but what i'd suggest that you do anyways is put on 48 fly five packs see how it feels and right after you fly those then put on 96 see how that feels and see if you like the feel of one more than the other because if you like the feel of 98 you're going to get more flight time so why not do that i kind of like 98 but I'm, I'm trying out mouse's tune and he recommends 48 on his tune so if i'm going to try out the guy's tune i'm going to try it out the way that he suggests to try it out so here we are we're flashing each of our ESCs. We make sure that we don't disconnect anything or whatever. We get it through and then it's going to be done. And then we're going to go into beta flight and mess around with some things too that I have no idea what I'm doing. But you can follow along if you want to or if that's all you needed. There you go. Now you can do this to all your, uh, basically all your flight controllers. You can do this on your whoops and you can do it on everything. And it makes a very big difference. Like it just... It makes things feel nicer. Okay, disconnect. What are you waiting for? Do it! Just do it! Oh, yes, you can! So sexy. Just do it! Okay, so now I'm going to go to beta flight and make sure my motors are all happy and doing the right thing. I still haven't disconnected them. And I still have my props on. I mean, of course not. I would never have my props on. Uh, motors. So we got to check all this stuff. We got our thingy on. I think my motors have 14. I hate counting these things. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, yes, 14. Hopefully not 15. I don't want to count again. Everything's coming very dangerously close, but nothing's touching me. Okay, so let's test these guys out. Oh, I always have reversed motors. Yes, because reversed motors, I don't know. I just like them reversed. Okay. Oh, accelerate. Wait, do I have my D shot? I got all my stuff. Okay, let's just let's just test it out and see if my fingers get cut off. Oh. Okay, so this is going out. This is going out. This is going out. Oh yeah, they're all doing what they're supposed to. Okay, so now actually I like to hear them one by one. That sounds okay. Ooh. That sounds very nice. Oh. Oh. That sucker's vibrating a bit. 
Ooh! Is that hitting something? That's what it is. It's hitting my bloody capacitor. Okay, let's take it away from the capacitor and try that again. Oh, that sounds very nice. That sounds okay as well. It's just the back one that doesn't sound the nicest. I, I feel like the motor orientation might actually be wrong. So now that we've done that, we're going to go and uh, stop the motors. And now we're going to do the motor, mo reorder motors. Because I think that they might be doing something a little bit funny. And I'm going to actually just connect my battery because I'm just like, uh, you know when you just do this and you don't have your battery on properly and you're just like, I'll just do it. But it's probably better to just strap it on so that it's not smacking everything and this build is so damn tight that it's easy to hit stuff. Let's do the motor, motor reorder motors. Okay, I understand. My props are definitely not connected. Okay, we got that one. That one. That one. That one. Okay, save. Okay, now let's see if they're still spinning the right way. <laughs> out. 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 Oh! So nice. And it's so much easier to do that on the, uh, on the big boys. Oh! It's connected! Life is good! Okay, is it alright? Throttle, yaw, pitch. Pitch, roll, yeah, mama. Okay, so now we're gonna give ourselves a little bit more, a little bit more like resolution by going here and making this 10. And then we're gonna go over here and making this 90. Look at all the extra resolution we have, yeah. Okay, that gives us more resolution. Did you know that? There's like a secret trick for hanging out with me. I, I gave you more resolution. You! Go into our modes, and arm is going to be flicky flicky. I like the, the top left switch to be flicked up. And then I'll teach you another little dirty trick. What you can do is you can also set arm to the top switch here so if you have this set for arm also yeah see you can set an add range here and then you can add another arm like this so you see it'll be armed when you're up and armed when you're down and if you do that when you're whoop racing you can put the flip where's the flip over you flip over after crash add range put that on the same stick down so now what's going to happen is i'm going to just leave it on this actually because so i'm armed but then if i get into an accident and i need to flip over i just go boom on the same switch it flicks so this is unarmed this is armed and that is armed so all the way up and all the way down is armed and in between it's not so i flick up armed fly do 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 do, do have a crash go down and now it's automatically going to do a flip over after crash with that so that's that's pretty cool i like that might be a little bit less safe but i don't know i like it add my range i put that on the bottom uh the bottom right flicker and that's basically all i really use i like to keep it simple but we're going to save this and then what we're going to do is we're going to enable expert mode we're going to go to adjustments and here we're going to set these all to aux 4, which is going to be my top right three switch. So you set here to aux 4. That'll be my top right three position switch. And here I'll put uh, rate profile adjustment. You yeah. rate profile selection. And then we got one over here. We'll have one over here, and we'll have one over here. And what this is going to do is on my right switcher, I'm going to be able to switch between uh, all sorts of different rates to test out things. So now let's go to the rates. Let's go to the PID tuning. So let's see what we do here. Yeah, dynamic dampening's off. The Ds, 
I'm gonna give myself a little bit more D because I yeah who who doesn't want a bit more D? Okay, uh, let's just put them together, right? Uh, let's keep, let's do that. Okay, let's do that. Uh, master multiplier. I'll put that down a touch because I just did those other things. I like this to be a little higher. Okay, and then VBAT sag. I'm gonna put this at 80 because that's what Angry Dawn does. So I like that. I don't know what this does. Thrust linearization improves low throttle authority, especially useful. Has no effect at higher throttle. The amount of compensation varied is enough. Okay, well, okay, let's try that. No, let's not. I don't want it. I don't think I want the anti gravity either. Shooter reduction, let's take that to 10. We're gonna save that. We're gonna go to the filters. Ooh, that's high. Oh, let's push this up a little bit too. Okay, very nice. Then I don't know what these things are, so we'll save them. We're gonna set up my rate. So we make sure that the flicker's in the right area. Okay, so on the top, these are, these are gonna be my rates. My rates are, do I remember my rates? Uh, I think they're 220 with 800 and 0.5. And then here we have 180, 800 and 0.5. And then here I have 160, uh, 600 and 0.5. Five, and that's how I like it. So we'll save that. Then we're gonna go to the next one, the next flicky flicker. And for that, I like to try whose rates Min Chan's. Let's let's just try it out. Let's try out Min Chan's and see if they're correct. Yeah, see, two thousand like they don't have the new one. Let's just do it. Okay, now let's just see if these rates are what I thought. Yeah, because I modified these for myself to make them more likable for me. I'll have my rates, Min Chan's rates, and an S Bang rates. We're not calibrating the accelerometer because we're not using it. We got everything set up nice. Ooh, we're turning that off because we don't care about it. We're gonna turn these on. These will allow the uh, drone to beep if it goes missing. Oh, we can set up our display. Shave and reboot. Okay, now we can go to our video transmitter. OHD. We like NTSC. NTSC is just better. Uh, PAL will have a slightly higher resolution. Like PAL is in 25 frames per second. NTSC is in 30 frames per second. So I'd rather have the five more frames per second yeah because that's the way to be now we got that and now the only things that we care about is our battery voltage battery average cell we want that we want our craft name i guess craft name or pilot name why is that not just on the same thing so craft name pilot name my name is I love you. I love you. I want you to always know I love you. So I always put that there for you. OSD, craft name, save, and put this up at the top. Put this over here. Put the craft name over here. You know what else I like? Well, this. Yeah, it's just nice to know. That is nice to know. I forget which timer tells you how long you fly. Just in case your voltage regulator dies, then at least you know how long you usually fly. But when you're done flying, post, it tells you... I think it's timer two. I think it's timer two. I like to keep it clean, man. I want it clean. I barely want to see anything. While we're waiting for Farouk's rates... Let's do a testy tester. Because who doesn't want to do a testy tester? Let's see if this destroys my house. Oh, uh, I was born. 
Sugar River, and I know, yeah, I know, change is coming. I was born by a river, and I know, yeah, I know, change is coming. Oh my god, the buzzer is on. Oh my lord. Okay, here we go. Do we have liftoff? Oh, mama. That sounds nice. The motors are a little warm, but not hot. I think we're pushing the tune to the finest of its abilities. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, we gotta find, we gotta find Farouk's rates. Another day wasted. But you know what? This one gonna fly good. This one gonna fly real good. I can tell. Now where are you, Farouk? Where are you? Where are you? I'm going to find your rights. I'm gonna find you and make you my lover. Love you better than your own mother. Okay, is that? Ooh, maybe that's it. Hope that helped. There are the rates, so you can put it into the third setting. If you don't understand how to do this, be sure to watch this video. This video explains what I'm doing with the three different settings for rates. Hurry up and click it before it disappears.